Welcome to Smooth Game. What's good with y'all, man? We back with yet another man video, baby. I forgot how pumped up this ball is, boy. But back here with another man, man reveal, man. Hey, before we get to it, I will go ahead and leave timestamps to different areas of the video down in the description, just in case you want to see certain parts of the video. We're gonna try to go through these a little quick. I understand they're probably a little bit, a little bit long. Like every video will only be in the 40s. We can probably do them a little bit faster. Uh, follow me on Twitter for a rundown of every video that goes up. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. If you knew, turn the post notifications on. Let me know what y'all think about the series, man. If y'all want to keep coming, if y'all wanted to join the next year, I said if Drew Brees retires, I'm doing it regardless. Like I told y'all, man, we're gonna get straight into the resigns at the end of the last episode. I told you we go ahead and start that up. And really the only ones on my mind to resign, um, Christopher Herndon, who's not ready yet. Henry Anderson, I'm gonna let walk. Really, he's the only one. I'm letting. I'm probably going to let Jeremy McCoy walk. It depends on how much money I have left. So we're going to go ahead and start with the biggest one, Jameson Crowder, who I think needs to be re-signed. Uh, we'll just go ahead and offer up this first contract. Fair offer is 45.1. So let's see if I can get him for 45. It won't hurt to ask. He's back. So that's one down. Fatuski, you're up next. He wants two years, 17 million. You're kind of young though. I want you for. I'm gonna try to see if I can get you for three years. That same kind of price tag. Ah, all right. So he needs more salary. We just have to remember that. And then John Franklin Myers. Um, did I want to keep you? Yeah, I do want to keep you. You want to? You're young too. I'm gonna try to get you locked up four years, twenty nine point three million. And now we locked him up for four years. He's going to uprise. He's only twenty four, so he can only get better. I see him getting probably mid mid to low eighties, which will be good. Especially since we're letting this one go. Um, with that being said, dang y'all. So we starting the video already off with an L. A confusing L too, like such good offense. 350 yards and we held them to 240. We just we just were finishing off drives is what I'm gonna guess. 262 and two touchdowns. Bridgewater 147 and two touchdowns. We got sacked four times, which isn't good. We let McCaffrey get 70. Drake only dropped 50 for me. Receiving Janu Smith, excellent game. 100 over 100 yards. Crowder two touchdowns. Who's giving up on our center who just got back from injury? Still giving them up. I couldn't explain to y'all why we didn't get it. Mosley and May come on for the sex, no INTs. Like I said, we just we just didn't finish our drives. And now we're coming back over here. I've got two breakout chances. We'll go ahead and look at this X factor. Get this out by the way. Um, never more stress. What can I say? We didn't get it done on defense. Yeah, but I mean, at least we held him, though. Breakout player a chance. Uh, really disappointed for Tuski. Oh, dang. I forgot he had a breakout player chance for that game. But it looks like he didn't get it. Uh, we got somebody going for it for this week. I'm not seeing a name. Oh, so now they want Janu Smith. Three touchdowns, 150 yards. Ooh, do we get a game early today? We might. Coming right back here, trying to negotiate with Fatuski one more time. He did say the salary's low, so we'll jump that up 4.5 million now. And we will go ahead and get him to stay. So there's only one other person that I would want to sign, and we have about 17, probably about 20 mil left. Um, I don't know if I'm signing Jerry McCoy. I might let him hit free season and try to sign him again. Hey, we just finished the practice up. Amon Ross St. Brown. Finally got his development shown. He is a superstar, which is great. That's that's great time. I think we got him second second round, third round. I, I think I traded to go get him too. Like I traded up to go get him. So that's that's how you make power moves pay off, bro. So after a long thing about it during that training session, we are gonna play this game and see if we can get him his uh, upgrade ability. This will be since he has an upgrade right here for superstar. So this will get us. At least to my knowledge now three people that are superstar level or higher and we're gonna jump into this game as soon as we go ahead and get some of these upgrades out the way go ahead and get gary jimmy slot rating up see you get a couple of upgrades there defensive tackle darius stills go ahead and get his speed rusher up the young rook he's our third string too so he hasn't had much playing time he's probably about to wait till the end of the season to get his you know what his development is and we got patty fisher I'll go ahead and just get his field, field general up. Plus one zone, tackle. 
Dang, so I did field general and I got two on the run stop. So that's now it's ain't that crazy. I upgrade field general and something else got more uh, upgrade points than that. Yeah, man. So Janu Smith, will he be a superstar? Will he be a bust? Three touchdowns or 150 yards to him today? Let's jump into this game. A new style with this one. Um, dang, I meant to lower the, the quarter length actually. Um, dang, that's kind of the first. I actually was gonna lower that. Oh, oh snap! Oh snap! Oh, we almost broke out! Oh, we almost broke out. But I'm gonna try a new uh, wave with this one today. Um, play some sim song. Let's see how it goes. 2,305 yards, 18 touchdowns, 9 interceptions on the season. Oh, Justin Fields, he's out there balling in the rookie year now, and like I said, not. I think I threw like four of those interceptions in the first game, so he's not throwing too many picks out here. All right, here we go, y'all. First attempt, like I was saying, yeah, we gonna try to send it some, play some, and just see how that kind of works out. Uh, see if we get some kind of different gameplay, quicker gameplay, funner gameplay. Get outside, baby. Yes, Todd Johnson, let's go. Run it to the residence, baby. Let's go. Oh, almost first play. You know what? Dance on him. Dance on him. Okay. Yeah, nobody's outside. This might be a good play right here. Second and goal. Yes, sir. Get outside. Get in there. I ain't running jet sweep. I don't know how long, baby, but let's go. That's a touchdown. We starting off the game right, baby. First career rushing touchdown. Yeah, we did all run plays. I almost forgot Janu Smith got a got a achievement. Uh, let's get to the first defensive drive. Right, if many of y'all remember last time we was out here, man, flat game was stupid. So we'll see if we can hold that today, what they're going to try to do today. Yes, sir. Run game locked up, though. Run game will always be locked up. No, sir, Togger. Second and 12. I'm going to put them that way since he's on that side because there's a better chance he's going to run that way. Oh, this went to the wrong gap. But like I said, I shifted that way because he's on the left side. He's going to run. Unless it's a counter back side, which I'll take that. If it's a counter back side, oh, well. So we know this one's going to be a pass. Got to be. Where are they going? Oh, screen. Screen. Get over there. Lock that up. Yes, sir. First defensive drive is a success. We're getting the ball back on offense. And this time we, I should probably keep running the ball again. I should have run defense with booty cheeks. But you gotta try to get the new Smith these yards. So now I'm gonna find plays that the tight end got is it's gonna get y'all. Oh, oh, gotcha. Oh snap. Oh snap. Oh yes, sir. Whoo! I wasn't ready to even commentate that one, boy, but we almost got ghost out of there. Okay, Crowder. To be honest with you, this play right here, the drive concept, might be what gets him on his yards. Dang, I did look. Oh, he's over here. Mm. Dang, I wasn't trying to go to the flats. To be honest with you, I might just have to give him the three touchdowns. We'll see what we can do about it. Last week, 10 for 134 on the season, he's got 500 yards, four touchdowns. He could possibly reach a thousand by the end of the year, maybe. All right, here we go. Spread out wide. Second and one. Oh yes, sir. Good you. I did somebody else that they was really guarding that. They really don't want Janu Smith to get these yards. Come on, give it to him. Give it to him. There you go. Catch and hold on for me. Just outside of the goal line. Gonna we'll hike this thing. Yep, good block. No, I tried to slide. Oh, I had to be quiet for that one because I didn't know if he was about to fumble or what. But we on the one. Now is where we can kind of get him something short. Let's see if I can get him open on this play right here. First and goal. Oh. I shouldn't have tried for that. So mad at myself for that. All right, so well, defense got to come to lock up this time. Once again, look up. <clears throat> he couldn't make the tackle, so I went ahead and get, went over there and made it for him. Just trying to be greedy and get that those points, but oh, that was bad for field tackle. It's all right. He's gonna have plenty more chances. Uh, we are very high scoring, at least when I'm controlling him. So he should have more chances to get that those touchdowns, those yards. Why are you not out there? He really just came inside the double team. Like, for what though? I'm gonna, I'm gonna that. 
I'm gonna get with it. I'm gonna come down here. Okay. Yes. I was a little slow on the read, so I don't know if I was gonna be back there for the pick. I was trying to bait him though, but we got there for the sack just in time, baby. And that was Quint Williams on that sack, boy. Yo, I haven't seen him do too much stuff other than get injured, at least when I come in these games to play, so it's nice to see him go out there and do something. Oh yeah, bait that. Come on. Yes, sir, Richard Sherman. Yes, sir, that's why you'll get a Richard Sherman. Yes, sir, that's why you'll get a Richard Sherman. Yes, sir, that's why you'll get a Richard Sherman. Yes, sir. Oh, great run back flex on him, Rich Sherman. Yes, sir. All right, so now we back on offense. I told y'all the goal is to try to get him these 150 yards. But we can't make that our only goal. But we can still throw him the ball, though. He's still going to be productive. Put him on the goal route. At least clear out the lane. So we get the thing to Crowder. Good play right there. All right, after that BS blocking play and holding call that we've had. Second and 16. We're going to drop back. One of our favorite plays. Oh, he followed it. He still got there to it. Followed it a little bit too late. You ain't trust yourself. When you don't trust yourself, you get beat just like that. Oh, yes, sir. I'm looking for that corner. There he goes. One of three. Two more to go. Next drop. This is where it's kind of hard for me to do something like this, man. Uh, I'm obviously going on my face cam off this so y'all can see everything on the screen. But in a game like this where we're playing such dominant defense and offense, it's hard to kind of come in here and super sim and just watch them throw it away. Look, nine yard pass. Incomplete pass. Oh, another incomplete pass? We'd love to see it. Punt. All right, let's see what the offense can do without me for the first time today. Seven yard rush by Crowder. 13 yard pass for Perryman. And like I said, this team is really good. Like, I've slick built a really dominant team in only one year. As we start the second quarter, still driving up the field. Janu Smith, seven yards. That's what, that's what I really need to see these blue lines go to. But look, run game on point. Pass game on point. Justin Fields running for it. 31 and seven yard game. First and 10, four yard game by field. Second and six. Ah, oh, damn, we losing yards. Come on, y'all. Come on, y'all, score for me. All right, complete pass. We're going to go ahead and take the field goal. Good, that's smart. But yeah, bro, I'm enjoying playing this as this team is literally not as bad as I thought it was going to be. I really thought it was going to be like at least a two, three year project. It's looking like we might be able to go win a bowl right now. Whether me playing or not, they, they are beasting and feasting without me. I say that and we give a 41 yard touchdown run to Gurley. Fourth and five, they missed the field goal. So we will go ahead and jump back into this thing. See if we can score real quick right before the half. I don't know if y'all saw, it said a goal for this drive was to get Justin Fitz's 20th passing touchdown of the season. We'll see if we can do it, but. Oh, thank goodness that wasn't a pick. That really was a good hole. I probably threw it a little bit too late. All right, second and 10 here. Trying to get another score right before the half, as we said. Anybody got a speed advantage on Minus two, minus one. Dang, that's kind of sad. Oh, yeah. Damn. Maybe if I joined earlier, but he got bumped, so I wasn't sure he was going to be open. Wait on it. Boom. That might be a touch. We might be to the residence. We might be to the residence. Let's go. I told y'all, we was coming back in the score before half. Scored a little too quickly, so now uh, let's play a little defense and really get into that. Actually, matter of fact, Scratch that. I'll show it to y'all something interesting. If not, halftime stats rolling. See if anybody gets a step. Oh, King and Drake didn't he cut the ball. Oh, okay, okay, okay. We're at the 29. Do we go for the touch? Nah. Just, we're gonna go ahead and get this field goal, man. Um 46 yarder. And we're just gonna go ahead and run into halftime. Oh, that goes in. 727. See y'all in the second half.
Uh, we're back in here, man. After the halftime, we're gonna go ahead and just do some simulating a little bit further. And we will kick off the fourth quarter with them having the ball. 34 to 10 is pretty much a blowout at this point. And I will simulate one more defensive drive. Looks like they're going for the fourth downs now too. Second and three, third and three, fourth and seven. They try to pass it. We got the ball back. All right. And before we get out here, I did just look at the stats real quick. Janu Smith needs like 92 more receiving yards and two more or two more touchdowns to go ahead and get his goal. So I'll see if I can get him either one. That's probably going to be picked. Dang it. I saw it too late. I saw it too late. That's all that was. It, it was open for a second, but I was watching Jimmy Smith a little too closely. So I'm going to keep trying to get him these yards. I'd love for her to be a superstar, but it's seeming more and more like that's probably not going to happen. Oh, I got to I gotta try that one. Pass interference? Yeah, give me all the yards back. We all the way up the field now. Dang, and our center just got hurt again. Here we go. First attempt at that big penalty. Oh yeah, break outside. Oh yeah, break that tackle. Ah, I did the truck. I didn't think it registered because he was mid broken tackle, but hey, it's all right. We still got the first first and goal. Short tail here return soon. Let the other dude come in. Low key, he be giving up less sacks anyway. There he go. That's two, three, one more. And there's enough time in this game to do it. We're probably just gonna go for the touchdown thing. So now it's just all about moving the ball up the field and getting him in position to where he can make a short catch like that to get me in. All right, and like I said, with the blowout win comes chances to test some stuff out. Uh, we obviously are up huge, so we don't necessarily need to just all out dominate. Negro, what are y'all doing? They was running up the field the sideline with him. Like, someone come make a tackle real quick. I'm gonna send a blitz at him. And they're trying another screen. Oh my gosh, my open field tackling is trash. Oh, oh yeah. Ah, oh, they picked it back up. I was there for the hit stick and everything to knock the ball out, but no one else was there to pick up the ball. And drop all the way down the field here with the nickel defense. Uh, Dang, I followed the wrong one. Well, that's the first time I gave up a touchdown today. Good thing we got a big lead, though. Oh, yes, sir. Oh. Ah. There it is. Superstar difficulty unlocked and achieved. And unless anything else exciting happens to, to this game, I'll catch up again. All right, here we go, y'all. After game stats, Matt Ryan threw the ball 51 times. He completed it more times than we even threw it. 356 yards, two touchdowns, and interception. As you can see, um, real quick, I'll show you the score summary. They did score one more time at the end. All that happened was they beat Richard Sherman on the goal route, even though I was in cover three. Some BS, but nothing really too worthy to show. Justin Fields, 20, uh, 20 for 28, 294, four touchdowns, two interceptions. Gurley rushed for 65 and a touch. As we all know, Crowder ran for a touchdown. Drake had a decent day. Fields had a great day for the amount of attempts that he had, thankfully to me. Janu Smith, 11 for 119, three touchdowns. Crowder went 7 for 120 and touchdown. Perryman and Drake were the only two people to catch a pass. Uh, no set or Lewis gave up a sack. And defensively, CJ Mosley was a beast. We had two sacks from Mer Myers, one for Bowser, one for Williams, and the interception for Richard Sherman, which we all saw. Here we go, the last person I said I wanted to resign. Uh, he's got, he's 25. I'm cool with signing him to, I'm cool with this deal. Three years, 11.8 million. And he is back. So we'll see if I decide to use my money on him or if I want to go to free agency and pick something else up. But for right now, we are the two seed. Obviously, Baltimore uh, took the one seed. We're fighting with the Bills for our division. 
right now you see it's uh, us we playing the broncos the raiders playing the browns jacks bills on the other side we got bucks lions giants vikings seahawks bears with the packers at the top it's it's two and five so you're gonna be close a close race because as i was saying us and the bills have the same exact record right now uh i think thankfully in the division we're three and one they're two and one i think we beat them already too so that keep that in mind before going to the next matchup as we look at the whole overall afc Ravens are just one game over, it's so 9-2, so that one seed, that home buy is still within our grasp. All right, y'all, with this game, man, we've officially swept the Dolphins. We're 2-0 with the Dolphins. We split with the Patriots, and so far we beat the Bills one time. That's a great way to play in your division. Now, although we gave up more yards than what we scored, we were still able to come up with the victory, scoring eight points in that fourth quarter, which is probably pretty crucial to us winning the game. I don't know if we did it first or after. Considering we went for two, we probably did it after, probably. Uh, 229, two touchdowns and an interception for for Fields. Two had a pretty great game. 280, two touchdowns, two interceptions. That's that's what we want. We want to force some turnovers, force you to make mistakes. Not really much from their run game. Drake had 90. Fields rushed for a touchdown. Receiving Crowder went for 72. The rookie went for 43. Perryman and Mims scored a touchdown. Ooh, went for 40 with a touch though. Uh, the center once again being the one that, that caused him set. So he might be out of here, but we might have to let him go and go pick up a new center. Be honest with you. We know what he's saying, but you see, Mosley and Cashman had the interception. Okay, a linebacker game getting in that. No, no DBs doing work. It seemed like the sacks came through via Cashman and Fatuski combined together for one. Great game out of us. We into the last stretch of the season. I think we're in the final four. Yep, final four. And this Bills game is gonna be real crucial. Let's we'll see what happens in the next two weeks. This is kind of depressing, y'all. We gave up the game here to the Texans. Once again, similar yards, just. I don't know. We gave up 12 third down conversions. Uh, they were very efficient in the red zone, being up there five times and scoring every time there. That's just not good red zone defense. 272, two touchdowns for Fields. Watson, 228, three touchdowns, doing his thing. What else can you expect? They got Phil Lindsay in the backfield, you know. No wonder. And then the run game was pretty much non existent. Crowder did his thing, 142 touchdowns. But other than that, everybody else kind of was like, you know, just average numbers. And the defense. I mean, we had a DB lead us in, in tackles again. You know how I feel about that. No interceptions, no fumbles. We just going to get to the next game where I bounce back. All right, y'all, and to end the episode, we get a dub here against the Buccaneers, 17-7. to Great game. Still, same thing, around the same yards. We had more conversions this time. Reds on defense was better. One for three for them. That's great. And we control time of possession. Now, 241, two touchdowns and interception for Fields, but we forced Brady to throw two interceptions, a touchdown 279, where the Saints should have did that when we had a chance to get him up out of there. So glad we beasted and feasted on him. Uh, run game, pretty average, 14 for 64, four yards of carry. Crowder, 81, and a touchdown leading the way again. Perryman also had a touchdown. Not much on the, on the sack department. 12 tackles for C.J. Mosley. Great game defensively. Myers had the lone sack for us. And interceptions came way of C.J. Mosley and Ashton Davis. Great game. Great game. As you can see from the playoff picture, man, now it looks like the Browns have took over as the one seed. Ravens dropping back to the fifth. We dropped all the way back to the fourth seed. Jags, Bills, three and six. Raiders, Patriots at two and seven. Other side, Cowboys, Vikings, Rams, Seahawks, Panthers, Lions, Packers. Now, the only reason that saddens me is, remember, we have the Seahawks pick. We both in the playoffs, that means we got just two late first-round picks, which kind of sucks. But it is what it is. You know, we'll, we'll play the Ravens. Ain't no big deal to me. As you can see, probably go through all this uh, next time when we come into the into the series. All this will basically be done. And next episode, we're really just going we're gonna to start with the game. And then we're going to see see what the Jags game is talking about. Probably what I'll do for the Jags game, depending on if it has any playoff implications, we'll jump into it, simulate it mostly, but jump into like clutch moments where maybe we need to score or something or need a, a clutch stop. But next episode should be the end of the season. And the episode of that, we'll be getting to the playoffs, man. So that does it for this episode. If you enjoyed the series, please leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. More gaming videos will be coming out. This rebuild series is pretty much the only gaming thing I'm doing right now. If y'all want to see something else, look, some Let's Plays or other sports games or anything like that, let me know. Uh, and yeah, man, this might be the Jets year. I might have been able to do this in just one in one season. So, it's been your boy, Sean to Smooth, a.k.a. Black Hokage, a.k.a. Black Avatar, a.k.a. Head of Smooth Legends Headquarters. Follow the Twitter so you know when your videos is coming up. 
comment down below if you're enjoying the series and I hope you're loving it because I'm having fun doing it. And I'm going to go ahead and get up out of here, man. Young Baldy, we gone? Peace.